All right. Hello and welcome to Tech Tuesday. Uh, I'm your technical specialist here at Cornerstone, Tom Levine, and today we're going to talk about the Cornerstone website. Uh, we've actually made a few significant changes in the last few months, and I wanted to highlight some of them for you that you may find useful, as well as walking you through some of the uh, differences and uh, important things on our new page. But uh, before we continue with that, just had a few points of housekeeping. Uh, first, if you have a question, please feel free to uh, type it in the box there. Hmm, no audio. Um, can everyone else hear me? Uh, if you can, okay, uh, it looks like a few other people can hear me. Uh, um, Denise, you might want to turn up your audio. That might be helpful. Um, one moment. Okay, sorry about that. Um, anyway, uh, we do have a bit of housekeeping. Uh, like I said, uh, please put a uh, question in the question box. I can uh, see that people are pretty familiar with it, uh, but uh, we will go ahead and answer your questions at the end of the presentation if we, um, you know, uh, if I don't think it's relevant at the moment. Um, if I do though, I'll probably answer it in the middle of the presentation. So please feel free to uh, put your uh, questions there. Also, uh, if you have any additional questions after the presentation and you don't feel comfortable just asking them in general and want to contact me directly, please do. I'm going to have this up at the end of the presentation as well, but uh, my phone number is 513-487-5390 and my email is tlevine at crnstone.com. Also, don't forget to follow us on social media, subscribe to the weekly Monday Minute newsletter for the latest in Cornerstone Carrier and industry updates. Also, and we'll be uh, covering some of this today, don't forget to sign up for the Cornerstone Marketing Hub. Uh, it's available when you sign up for our resource center and uh, it has everything from downloadable social media images to customizable flyers. Uh, Cornerstone's Marketing Hub has what you need to start managing your marketing in-house. Uh, you can access the Marketing Hub through our resource center, like I said, with your username and password. And if you have any questions or just have any you know, reservations before signing up, please feel free to reach out to Jess Larkin. Uh, this is more her project and she'll be able to help you out with anything uh, that you need clarified. Her email address is jlarkin at crnstone.com and I will uh, put that in the chat real quick uh, just because I will not be displaying that again at the end of the presentation. There we go. Also, don't forget to register for our cash incentive program. Uh, we'll be actually covering where you can find the registration link here in a bit. But uh, when you uh, sell more, you earn more, uh, or at least possibly. Uh, for all group and individual new business sales between January 1st of 2023 and December 31st of 2023, you earn points that bring you closer to that $7,000 cash prize. Uh, for more details, uh, don't forget to check out our website, uh, www.crnzone.com slash cash dash incentive dash program, and uh, it will also give you the chance to register if you haven't yet. Also, uh, don't forget about our Refer an Agent program. You can earn up to $250 with our Refer an Agent program. You just submit a referral through our website by contacting your uh, corners or by contacting your Cornerstone representative. Uh, then you just uh, track or we track and monitor your uh, referral over the next six months. And then uh, once they submit business within that six month period, you earn a $250 bonus. Uh, it's pretty straightforward and pretty easy. Uh, all you got to do to uh, do so is just go to www.crnstone.com slash refer dash and dash agent. Uh, as per usual, uh, we have a lot of exclamation points afterward, but uh, that is not a part of the URL. So if you're going right there, just uh, don't include the exclamation mark. And uh, last point of clarification before we really get into this, um, after my last webinar on AGB, we did have a few 
questions uh, regarding Medicare commissions. So I just wanted to clarify. Uh, AGB is our system that lets you as a broker access all of your commissions data, uh, some other useful tools and things about uh, what we have on file here at Cornerstone, lets you view your block of business that we have on file, as well as see any important notices that we might decide to push out. Um, that being said, uh, it is not actually where you'll find most of your senior commissions. Uh, back in 2018, Cornerstone sold our senior block to Integrity, which is our uh, close business partner. And uh, they broke off our uh, senior block into their own division called Cornerstone Senior Marketing. We still work closely together. We're even in the same offices. Uh, but if you're trying to follow up on commission questions or anything uh, like that for senior, you'll want to reach out to them directly. Uh, they use a separate system called Forma to track commissions, so you will not find that in AGB. Um, that being said, we do work closely together and we can guarantee that all of your senior needs will be met by CSM. Uh, they're pretty wonderful people over there. So uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us directly as well. Uh, we'll be happy to direct you to the right place. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, this is the base view of our website. And actually, I kind of like the clean look of it. Uh, we have our uh, top banner right here on our homepage, which is just www.crnstone.com. And uh, just for ease of access, I'm going to put that in the chat as well. Uh, right here. Uh, you can click on that URL just to get ready there, or uh, you can go directly to it with www.crnstone.com. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and actually close out of my browser window and open up uh, Firefox again, just to show you how you navigate there. Actually, the funny thing is I think I have it set as my home page, so I'm probably going to have to go elsewhere and then go back to Cornerstone. So let's go to Google. Here we are. And uh, all you have to do to get to our website is go to www.crnstone.com, just like the last part of our emails. And you will get to our main homepage. Uh, this page is just where you land, uh, but you have some quick links that you can jump to from our main page. Uh, you can jump to individual and family divisions right here, uh, employee benefits and learn more about what we offer, uh, licensing commissions or our agency services program right here. And if you keep scrolling down, then you can see our core values, our mission statements, uh, and other general information about Cornerstone, as well as some testimonials uh, from Jerry M., Brett H., and Deborah K. If you keep scrolling down on our page, uh, you'll also find links to some news articles and some quoting templates. Uh, and this is also where you can sign up for our weekly newsletter. If you just scroll down to the bottom of our page, uh, you can just fill out your first and last name and email address, hit submit, and you'll start receiving that. Uh, you can also unsubscribe at any time. So don't feel like uh, locking yourself into that. It means you can never unsubscribe and it'll just clutter up your inbox. That being said, the main way that I'd recommend uh, at least uh, scrolling through our website or trying to find different sections is actually by using this ribbon up here at the top of our web page. As you can see, if you scroll down, that ribbon kind of follows you. Uh, and if you go to who we are, you can learn more about us directly. If we go to core leadership, it'll take me a second to load, sorry. Mm. You can see all of our um, advanced uh, business team, and you can see all of the people that uh, really kind of help direct Cornerstone as far as what we offer. Uh, you see Annie and Ryan are our co-owners. Uh, John's still on as a chairman. Uh, Bill is our CFO. Natalie is HR. And uh, Luke is our vice president of sales and operations. Also, uh, you can use the quick link down here to contact us directly as well. You can also check out our open positions directly from this section of our web page. Also, if you click on community involvement, you can learn a little bit more about what we do to help support our local area. Uh, we have supported several different local charities over the years, and we also like to uh, do the Mayor's Challenge, which is what you see this banner from up here, where we uh, do a lot of work with the Cincinnati Parks, and we just kind of beautify things, get ready for the uh, park season. Uh, it's actually really interesting, and if you'd like to learn more, you can click on that CS in Action section right here. 
Uh, you can also learn about some of the other things we participate in in more detail by using these drop downs below in this section. Uh, Adopt a class, the Mayor's Challenge, Light the Night, uh, Free Store Food Bank is who we support a lot as well. And uh, there's a lot more to learn from this section as well if you're interested in joining us. Uh, we also have some uh, pictures from some of those uh, community involvement events here as well, if you're curious. We also have the What We Offer section, which kind of dissects what each of our divisions do in more detail. Uh, it's going to be pretty interesting if you'd like to learn more about our divisions. Uh, we have Individual and Family, uh, Employee Benefits, our ASP Services Program, Licensing and Commissions, our Cash Incentive Program, which you can find more info on here, and our Refer and Agent Program. Uh, a lot of this information is stuff you'd probably already know. Uh, individual and family employee benefits are the two main ones, uh, but I did want to highlight some of the other ones down here before we uh, get into the Resource Center. First off, uh, ASP is kind of our overall uh, you know, package for how we can help your business directly. Uh, as a cornerstone broker, you can access our services directly. And uh, if let's say you have a client looking for LTD coverage, but you don't offer it, uh, that's really what this program is more for. Uh, you can put them in contact with us and uh, it kind of operates on a similar uh, framework as our for an agent program. There are actually four separate divisions of this, uh, autopilot, parachute, and a flight plan, and I believe the client referral section, which is right over here under ASP resources, the client referral form. Um, a autopilot is, you know, more of our uh, full licensing uh, program. Uh, it's you refer us business and we can kind of take care of that there. Goes hand in hand with the ASP resources section. Uh, then there's parachute, which is our succession planning. Uh, if you're planning on uh, kind of leaving the business and you'd like to uh, maybe uh, get a little bit uh, off the top or uh, see what more we can offer you for that, uh, that'd be our parachute program. And then we have a flight plan. Well. Actually, flight plan is more of that section. It's really more something you should discuss with your broker advisor, uh, but you can read more about it here. Uh, we also have hot links over here on the left-hand side, which is something we have through most of these other sections as well. As you can see, we have the uh, jump to licensing commissions, cash incentive, and refer an agent. If we hover over what we offer, that is the same kind of section that we have up here. So instead of going back up to the ribbon, if you're in this section and you want to uh, jump around a little bit, then you can do that just by looking under this section over here on the left, uh, going straight back into licensing and commissions. Uh, this is also where you used to go in order to get directly to AGB. Uh, that is somewhat the case. You can still get there by clicking on a few links, but there's a more direct way to get there. And I'm going to show you that here in a second. Uh, it kind of discusses the difference between our licensing and our commissions team. Uh, it discusses how we pay commissions here as well. And if you're trying to get to AGB, uh, all you have to do is go to licensing commissions, then go to AGB broker suitcase. It'll load up here, and then you can click on login. I'm going to right click and open it in a new tab to show that yes, you can indeed get directly to AGB from here. Uh, you can also get there directly by just going to www.agbohio.com. And if you don't have uh, access just yet, then you can also request that from our Cornerstone AGB page. Uh, once you click on AGB under our uh, section over here for licensing commissions, to register, all you have to do is scroll down and register right here. Uh, that says uh, questions, ready to sign up. And you just go ahead and fill out this information, uh, hit submit on the referral, and it'll send us an email and I'll reach out to you to get you set up on AGB. Additionally, uh, under the what we offer section, we have more details about our cash incentive program. And this is also where you'd go to actually register for that. All I did was go to what we offer, cash incentive, and it dissects a little bit more in detail about that competition. Uh, we have all of our prizes posted up here as well, and our sponsors listed below. Also, if you have any uh, questions or if you'd like to register, you can reach out to us below 
by registering here or by uh, giving us a call or sending us an email. And the last section here is the Refer an Agent program. If we select Refer an Agent, then it talks a little bit more about how you can uh, refer agents here on this page. Uh, it has step one, two, and three, which I covered in our uh, intro to this presentation. And you can register by just uh, filling out this information below. In fact, if you hit uh, Submit Your Referral, it'll just scroll down to that bottom part of the page. And before we continue on to the Resource Center, I just want to cover this bottom bar down here. This is on pretty much every single one of our uh, site pages, and it's just another kind of copy-paste of what we have up above here. Uh, we have who we are, our Resource Center, which you can log into directly from here, as well as the What We Offer section that we just covered. Uh, you can also directly link to our News and Events sections uh, down here, uh, but you can also get to that in the News section up above here in our uh, browser uh, ribbon as well. That being said, let's cover the most significant change, which is the Resource Center. Now, this is the big one, and actually it locks some sections here if you registered with us or not. Uh, the Resource Center is kind of an expansion off of AGB. Uh, what it does is it lets you access some specific information that we actually can't host there. Uh, these would be things like our weekly webinar series recordings, uh, our marketing hub, uh, some news information, although you can view what news articles we have listed, you can't actually get to them unless you register. Uh, we have our group quote template, our client referral form, as well as uh, the benefit limits guide, individual carrier maps, and some other useful information as well. So uh, all you need to do to register is go to Resource Center, log in, and it will give you a prompt to log in if you're an existing user, uh, which I am. I'll go ahead and do that in a second. Or you can just click on the uh, register here link right under the login section, and it will direct you to how to register. And I click on that here, and it'll bring you to our registration page. If you fill out this information, it will let you register for this section of our website, and it is different from AGB. Uh, once again, if you're trying to access AGB directly, uh, you can go to what we offer, licensing missions, follow that same path I did before, or you can go directly under Resource Center to AGB and just scroll down to the bottom and you should be able to sign up once the page loads. There you are. Uh, some other locked sections under our Resource Center though are access to the webinar series, our marketing hub, like I said. And uh, to get access to this, all you have to do is log in or register. Uh, you can also do that directly by clicking on the register as a new user link here from one of the locked pages. Or if you're an existing user, you can log in. I'm gonna go ahead and log in at this time. So I'm gonna drag off screen real quick while I register. Uh, don't want to show my username and password, unfortunately. But once I have that set, then I will go ahead and drag it back over. Here we are. Uh, so once you log into the Resource Center, it'll link you directly back to this page. It's the same login section as before. It just shows that I am currently logged in. In fact, up in this top bar here, uh, because I'm technically listed as an admin, uh, I do also have that access, but you can ignore that section. When you log in, you shouldn't see that top bar saying how like uh, the um, details of our WordPress. Hmm. Excuse me. Uh, anyway, let's go back to that webinar series page. Now that we can actually see it, uh, this webinar series page is kind of the full list of all of our recordings for all of our Tech Tuesdays, uh, as well as all of our other webinars. Uh, this would be Build Your Brand, the Group Corner, the Individual Corner, and any other special webinars that we have highlighted from carriers throughout the year. Uh, we had a few uh, last year with, I believe, Doug Becker was his name. Uh, I always blank on it. But uh, we have a lot of industry experts that we bring on to these as well. And you can access the full list of recordings here. Uh, 
Uh, if you, let's say, wanted to review some of the individual corner, uh, you just select individual corner from this section up here. And if you uh, scroll down through, you can see all of these links for recordings. In fact, if I click on one of those links, it'll actually open up the recording in YouTube and you can go directly there to watch. It's going to take a while to load here, um, but as you can see, the video pops up and it loads out the rest of your recommendations as well. Uh, once again, we actually do have a YouTube page for this as well. It's Cornerstone Brokers Insurance Services Agency, comma, Inc. Uh, if you'd like to subscribe there, then you can see all of our recordings as well. Additionally, uh, if you go to uh, Group Corner, you can see all of our Group Corner webinars. Same thing with Build Your Brand and Tech Tuesday. Uh, as you can see, we even have our AGB recording up right now, as well as Excel features to keep in mind and better browsing solutions. Also, you can see the list of our upcoming webinars in this section as well. Uh, we've got the one that I'm currently doing right now, uh, the 9.30 to 10, the individual corner, and the uh, Build Your Brand coming up. In fact, if you just click on Upcoming Webinars, it'll link you to our events section, which I will get to here in a second as well for how to navigate directly to there. Uh, but this section is also locked by the Resource Center login. Uh, you can look through all of our calendar here, or you can just do a generic search for events, such as Tech Tuesday. Hit Find Events. and it will show you all of the Tech Tuesdays on the calendar. You can even subscribe to our calendar uh, down here by clicking on the link below and then selecting whatever uh, file you use, I guess. Uh, if it's Google Calendar, iCalendar, Outlook 365, Outlook Live, all of this type of information. Uh, you can also export the ICS file directly, um, but I'd recommend against that just because it, you know, it'll be more up to date if you link this directly into your scheduling. So going back to the Resource Center, uh, let's go to the Marketing Hub next. If you click on the Marketing Hub, this is the section of our site that will let you really more easily customize some of your marketing directly. Uh, it's a lot of our design and resources that are generic that you can use as one of our brokers for free. Uh, it may require a Canva account, uh, which you can sign up for right here. It's free as well. Um, but you can search for different types of things using our search bar if you're trying to find a specific template. Uh, one of the ones that we actually like to highlight is our custom ACA open enrollment postcard. And you can uh, click there to download it and customize it as you wish. I'd really recommend exploring some of these options before you hire an outside design firm to uh, take over your marketing just because it's there, it's available to you just as a cornerstone broker, and it's something that's really easy to use and customize. I think Canva is pretty user uh, intuitive. Uh, there's not a lot to it that's really hidden, but if you have any questions, uh, you can always reach out to Jess Larkin. Uh, her email's already there, and she's probably more than happy to help you out with a little bit of it. Um, Canva also has great user support, so if you're having trouble, you can always reach out to them directly as well, and they should be able to help you out. In order to access it, you just click download, and it will link you directly to the Canva page to uh, actually include the design. I'm gonna go back here real quick to our website. Uh, but like I said, you can sign up there and you can search for what we have here in the Resource Center as well. Now then. Uh, next up, we have AGB. Uh, this is the direct link to the section that I clicked to before from our uh, commissions and marketing resources under what we offer, licensing and commissions. Uh, this is just a direct link here. You can click directly on the login button here to log into AGB, or uh, you can just uh, contact support right here. You can sign up by clicking on sign up, which will just scroll you down to the bottom of the page like we covered before. We also have access to FormFire here as well. If you click on the uh, FormFire link, this part is not actually locked by the login, but uh, you can access FormFire Direct here by clicking on login, as well as uh, you know requesting access with this link here. 
And you can also find some additional details on pricing. Uh, we tend to keep these uh, pretty up to date. So the pricing is very direct and uh, you know all displayed here. You can also access our broker resources for FormFire right here, which include all of the information on how to actually use FormFire, as well as how to uh, do things like what if a client's tax ID number is already on use and some other frequently act asked questions, uh, things like how to assign an a HR manager, how to send out forms, as well as doing things like understanding user account types. So it's a pretty useful page. You also gain access to employer resources and employee resources of Form Fire here as well under this frequently asked questions section. You can also register to request access for uh, Form Fire through us uh, down here below just by filling out this section of our site as well. And if we scroll down further, you can see we're kind of at the end of our page here. Moving on, we also have access to Health Sherpa through the Cornerstone website. Health Sherpa is what we recommend you use, and it is absolutely free. All you have to do is request access. Uh, you can also directly link to the login page from this site as well. And we have a little blurb about the benefits of using Health Sherpa here in conjunction with uh, just those links to the Health Sherpa page. You can even sign up directly by filling out this form as well. Uh, Health Sherpa is, I believe, only available through us for Ohio, Kentucky, Indiana, um, but uh, it might also be available for other states. I'd recommend reaching out to your broker advisor to learn a little bit more uh, in-depth information about Health Sherpa, uh, but this is a section of our website that is pretty frequently used. Also, we have a direct link to Benefit Book Builder, EB3, uh, from our website as well. It's a fully customizable Benefit Booklet Builder, and you can uh, watch the YouTube video here for a little bit more information on the demo. And you can even request access directly from this link. We also have pricing information and registration information here as well. Now, the last big section I think that I'd recommend covering is events. Uh, this is available directly under News. In fact, if we uh, click on News, and this is one of the main points, uh, and it'll take a minute to load, but if you click on News, it actually links you directly to this page, which kind of covers a lot of the news and information and industry updates that we like to highlight. A lot of these get pushed out in our weekly newsletter as well, but uh, if you aren't subscribed and don't want to subscribe, you can access that information here. Mm. Now, the one caveat to that is even if you don't have a uh, resource center login, uh, which you can log into right here, uh, you can actually see this page. It'll kind of show you the highlights, it'll show you the blur below, and it'll show you all of that kind of general information. But if you want more in-depth info and you want to actually read what we have, and you click on something under here, unless you are logged in, then you won't actually be able to see any of this information. And I'll go back and show you that in a second after I uh, finish talking about the join us and contact section, uh, but uh, just to show you that you can't access that without a login, but uh, you absolutely cannot access more information unless you create a resource center login. So once again, that's just under news in general. Sorry, I clicked on the uh, wrong link there. But uh, then you can see all of this info Let's just click on the MMO information here to kind of show that off a little bit. You can uh, click here to access this flyer from this link as well, and all of this really useful information on Medical Mutual, on the de-implementation on COVID-19 coverage. Pretty useful link. Also, if you hover over News and click on Events, then you get right back here to the events page that I covered a little bit earlier. Uh, this events section kind of covers all of the different events that we have coming up. Uh, for instance, we have all of our webinars scheduled here. We have the Cornerstone Q and Cafe listed, as well as some other events as well, such as the Cornerstone Summer CE Series, uh, which is listed here on, I believe, April 20th. Uh, so that was already covered. Uh, but uh, coming up, let's just go ahead and move over to the next month. I'm going to click on that next arrow, and it'll move you over to May. Uh, you can also navigate this pretty directly just by clicking on the This Month link to get directly back to the month that it currently is. Or if you click on this drop down here, 
you can just uh, scroll through all of the months for all of the years, and you can even see some of our past events. Uh, for instance, let's look at what we have scheduled in June. We don't really have a lot out there just yet. Uh, we like to keep things kind of flexible, but as you can see, we already have the Cornerstone Q&A Cafe scheduled for June currently. And if we wanted to go back to some prior information, you could go back to 2022 July, for example, and see a history of the events that we actually had back then as well. Either way, that covers the news section. And then the last section that we really have is contact. If I click on the contact section, it'll have some information about how to contact us. Uh, we have our Cincinnati headquarters right up here, but we also have information on how to contact each of our sub offices, uh, Athens, Columbus, Dayton, Toledo, and our Northeast Ohio office as well through this section. Just click on the tabs up above there. It'll also show you our hours of operation. You can also send us a direct email just by filling out this form here and adding a comment. Uh, I sometimes answer those, so does Jess. So uh, either way, our goal is to get back to you within 24 hours of your email. So if you have any questions on the site or anything more general, please feel free to make use of that to contact us. You can also directly submit a client referral just by going to contact, submit a client referral. And it'll link you directly to our client referral page. Uh, you can just fill out some information about the client here, uh, your agency name uh, and your agent info, as well as some comments, maybe some context about how to contact them or what they're looking for as well through this section. There is another section up here called Join Us, and uh, just in case you're new, uh, I just wanted to cover that you can click on this to just go ahead and find out more about who we are. That links back to this section up above here, as well as uh, giving you the ability to register with us for a few different carriers. We have quite a few listed down here, as well as some general information about us as well. But you can fill out this section to join us today. And uh, that about covers our tour of the website. Uh, if you have any other questions, please feel free to uh, fill out the questions section or uh, just go ahead and uh, ask them directly to me. I'll show my contact information here in a second. But right now I'm gonna go ahead and log out of our resource center. Go back to the Cornerstone webpage. And show you one more time about that news section like I was talking about. If I uh, go to news, and then try to click on an event without logging in, uh, let's just say this uh, HSA plan, for example, it'll prompt you to log in as a user before you actually gain access to that information. So that's one of the main benefits to actually having an account with our resource center. Uh, you can also link directly there from AGB as well. Uh, we have a section there that I covered last week uh, that will just directly link you there if you want to access that from AGB. Um, so if you have any other questions, like I said, please feel free to uh, put them in chat. Uh, otherwise, uh, feel free to reach out to me directly. My phone number, like I said before, is 513-487-5390. And my email address is tlevine at sierrainstone.com. We're always happy to help here at Cornerstone. And I hope you learned something new about our site and have a great rest of your Tech Tuesday. Thank you.